Tonight on the Health Watch, the state might have to close the doors to a new health insurance program. The Badger Care Plus core plan started for childless adults in July, and its popularity might mean waiting lists or program changes. News Reese Jess Garp joins us now to explain. Jess. Well, Eric, the state says unemployment numbers are driving up demand for the core plan, and they're closely monitoring numbers to see when they might have to make changes. Right now, the plan for low income childless adults has 26,000 people enrolled and another 34,000 in the pipeline. The state has a limit of about 50,000 people it can support with 154 million in federal and state dollars. So they're considering whether a waiting list after that limit is the right thing to do or changes to benefits are in order to keep health care coming. You know, this is a program with limits. It has a financial limit. It has eligibility requirements like having gone without health insurance for 12 months. Those are things that in a perfect world, you know, in a, in a world where we were able to get affordable health care to people, we wouldn't have those limits. So it comes at the worst time, you know, people really needing help and shutting the door on a program. It's a sad thing to see. Uh, people need help. And ultimately, we're all going to pay for it anyway. ABC for Help Health helped at least a thousand people sign up for the core plan so far, and says demand is still coming. They hope the program remains open even after the limit. Now, as far as the timeline for when this limit might be reached, Secretary Timberlake says with the attrition rates and other factors, there's a chance things could continue without hitting the top. But there are more than 34,000 people to sign up and that can take anywhere from 30 days to five weeks with the backlog. That Just have, another right? hurdle in the world of health insurance. Jessica Arp reporting tonight. Jessica, thank you.